Hey everyone, Wags here from Eagle Dynamics. In this DCS AH64D video, we'll delve into the ability of the AH64D to search for, acquire, and track a laser designation that is not from our own aircraft. This could be from another aircraft, a UAV, or a Joint Terminal Attack Controller, or JTAC. Laser Spot Tracking, or LST, is a useful feature when you have an off-board designation source at your disposal. Let's get started. Okay, so let's take a look at LST in operation. Now, the first thing, of course, we're gonna need is a laser designation source, and that's gonna be a Reaper orbiting way over there somewhere. So let's go ahead and uh, contact them to designate some targets. So to do so, we're gonna contact him on UHF-251. So it's RTS-1 down, select that radio. Open your dialogue and call him. Check in for 15. Uzi 1 1. This is Ford 1 1 1 8864. Yankee Bravo 4 2 7 8 400. Armed with laser hellfire 300 cannon. Time on station is 0 plus 15. Available for tasking. What do you have for us? So now the most important thing there was the laser frequency that is going to be designating the target that we're going to have the LST look for, and that was 1678. So let's uh, get the aircraft set up and we'll look for that. So master arm to arm, walls up the Hellfires, and let's set up the code now. So our LST is currently on A. You can see that's 1688. That is incorrect, so we need to be 1678. And we don't have any channels assigned to that, so it's super easy to create it. So go to Frequency. Let's say we'll set it to channel B. One, six, seven, eight. Press B. Enter. And now uh, cheap, uh, B channel is one, six, seven, eight. Let's go back to Code. Set LST to B, which is one, six, seven, eight. And come back out now in the LST box or window we can see it's a B channel which is 1678 much better okay let's reach back out to him ready to copy remarks use laser hellfire final attack heading 0240 wind 111 at 5 meters per second 220 Yankee Bravo 4052752 Final attack heading 000240 zero, 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 zero. Read back correct Report IP inbound Ford 11 one, one. IP inbound Ford 11 one, one. continue Okay now we're going to ask them to turn on the laser on 1678 Ford, one, one. Laser on. Laser on. Blazing. And now we're going to look for it. So we're going to do that from the uh, right hand grip. And here at the top we have A, O, M. So A for automatic, O for off, and M for manual. If we go up for automatic, it will do a four bar raster scan of where the uh, TAS is looking and looking for that code of 1678. If we go to the middle, off, as you might imagine, it turns off the LST and re-enables the LFRD for our own laser designator. Or if we go to a manual, it'll allow us to manually steer around uh, where the LST sensor is looking for that signature. So let's go to automatic, so we're simply going to press uh, up on the switch. Found a target. Let's 
go ahead and zoom in a bit. Pretty close. So let's hit O for off. So now we can slew around our tads. I'm going to IAT him and radio back and let him know that we spot the laser. Forward, one, one, spot. And we're in. Forward, one, one, in from the north. Forward, one, one, cleared hot. Okay, now I'll engage. Laser. And rifle. Okay, now I'm simply going to press up again. Easy is actually tracking based on that uh, laser designation from that Reaper. Go off. Let's get a little closer. Auto track. Laser. Rifle. Shift. A couple more points in closing. If you select the slave button, the tads will enslave to the acquisition source and cease an LST search or track. You can use the LST when tracking a target using the IAT or MTT functions, but the LST functions overrides those of the IAT. The TADS will continue to maintain an image auto track on the primary and secondary MTT tracks while performing LST functions, but if those tracks remain outside of the TADS field of view for too long, they may be dropped. However, if the LST loses the laser spot most tracking while in manual mode or the LST is switched to off, the TAS will slave back to the IAT primary track if it was able to maintain an auto track on it. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you next time. Thanks. Target destroyed. Ford, one, one. We are at the end of Vol and are checking out. Stay safe down there. <laughs>